Okay, so this is Inventor 2015 and many people asking me how to construct a tower using 3D Sketch so that is the purpose to do this uh, demonstration so as usual I'm going to open a standard part and to have a tower that I'm going to start using uh, XZ as the base plan and you can see that we need to have a base and I'm used that base plan to sketch a 2D and I will give a rectangle center rectangle will be good so give dimension for that and I will give 1000 millimeter which is equivalent to one meter fit view and I will give 1000 millimeter as well over here so I have a base which is 1000 times 1000 or 1 meter times 1 meter and I will get to the view that I comfortable with click the angle standard isometric view and I'm going to finish the sketch over here now if I want to get a tower I need to have another work plan I will create that work plan let's say the tower it is 5 meter up so I will give 5 meter fit view so I offset a work plan 5 meter you can use these tools distance to measure the distance between these two working plans and you can see definitely it is a 5 meter so this is a way actually we can create work plan for us to construct a tower so on the new work plan I will continue to do a 2D sketch and I make a rectangle on this new work plan uh, that is slightly smaller than the 1000 times 1000 let's say I will give 500 millimeter and 500 millimeter for that so now you see top and bottom the rectangle they are different in profile and now I use 3D sketch and I will pin on the corner on the top at the corner of the bottom rectangle I connect them and you see that now I combine using 2D sketch and 3D sketch and give me a tower that it is not just like a box but a tower that will be looks like uh, slanting to a certain angle So now I combine these two techniques and I can create a tower. So by having this skeleton framework, I can use it to do the frame generator. So now I can save the file. And that will be good.